woe to robbers of the church. We're talking about eight woes. We've been looking at Matthew chapter 23. We talk about woe to the robbers of heaven, people who are acting like leaders, supposed to be leading people to heaven, leading them to hell. Woe to the robbers of widows going in and taking widows' money and taking advantage of them instead of loving them and taking care of them. Now today, we're going to talk about woe to the robbers of the church in verse number 15. Woe unto you, scribes and Pharisees, hypocrites, for you can pass sea and land to make one proselyte. And when he is made, you make him twofold more the child of hell than yourselves. Wow. I mean, to take, not getting the job done. Jesus said these Pharisees would go way around the mountain to get a proselyte. Then when he'd get them, it would lead them to Jesus. It would lead them to ten times worse shape than they're already in. In other words, they're making them their disciples instead of Jesus' disciples. My job here at Timberlake Baptist Church is to not make y'all Walterites or Yanceans. It's my job to make you Christians, point you to Jesus, point you to his good effects. These Pharisees, their greatest admiration was for themselves, and they want everybody to be like them. No, our greatest admiration ought to be for Jesus, and we ought to want to make everybody like him. And make them reflect his light. May that be your strength for today. And your hope for.